What's going on guys, Andrew Pillock Hockey here back with another video and it looks like one of the big dogs is off the market. Matt Duchesne is likely headed to the Nashville Predators and if you're watching this and the deal is already, already confirmed, I know, it's it's basically been leaked already and uh, I'm sure if, if you don't live under a rock, I mean everybody knows that this was likely coming after the Nashville Predators traded away P.K. Subban to the New Jersey Devils in a, what was essentially a cap dump for them to get some assets but to get Matt Duchesne and this contract would look unreal looking at some of the contracts that have been signed lately Matt Duchesne might come in uh, with an AAV at eight million dollars according to Chris Johnston so that would be a wicked deal for them now Bob McKenzie uh, tweeted out some stuff and so did Pierre Lebron and uh, so did Darren Dreger but Pierre Lebron said uh, as others have also speculated while well, nothing can be signed uh, until Monday, Matt Duchesne slated to join Nashville. Contract can't be officially negotiated until Monday, but we all know it's being negotiated. But sounds like $56 million over seven years is what has been discussed. Uh, Bob McKenzie also tweeted, adding to that tweet, Nashville GM David Poyle doing good uh, work here. Although it never hurts when a player is uh, predisposed to be really uh, to really want to play for a certain team in a certain city. Either way, eight million dollar AAV projected for Duchesne. Darren Dreger also added that expects significant signing bonuses uh, in this contract as well, which isn't a huge surprise. It looks like this deal uh, is going to be done. Now, I, I think, like I said, the, this deal is pretty significant for for Matt Duchesne. I, I thought that he did well when he played with Columbus. Not as as much, you know points as he probably would have liked 12 points in 23 games played and then in the playoffs though he showed up quite well 10 points in 10 games played five goals and five assists but uh, with the Ottawa Senators 50 games played he had 58 points uh, the year before that he had 49 points in 68 games played so Duchesne has, has put up some really good numbers over the years and uh, even going back to his Colorado Avalanche days um, I was looking back here because I thought I had hung my my Avalanche jersey here, but I didn't. But anyways, uh, this is a great deal. Like I said, I think that getting him at an $8 million AAV, a lot of people were tweeting out looking at the Kevin Hayes deal and going, oh boy, compare that $7 million, over $7 million AAV to a, getting a guy like Duchesne who on a long-term deal getting $8 million is, is going to be a pretty decent deal when it, you know you look at the big picture. The cap is always going up. And he's only 28 years old. He's a centerman, so you're paying a bit of a premium for that too. And it, it, this contract looks good. The the Nashville Predators have always found ways to get good players onto good contracts in my eyes. Of course, that Subban deal wasn't signed by them, and Subban's a little bit overpaid at a $9 million cap hit, but that's not their problem anymore. They're um, allotting their dollars to Duchesne and hopefully a Yossi extension and getting everything done there. Uh, depending on when you're when you're watching this video, some of that stuff could be done. But when free agency opens, Matt Duchesne will be a member of the Nashville Predators. And like it's been said in some tweets, he is a guy that's been vocal apparently about wanting to go to Nashville. And I think that he kind of fits there. When you think about it, there's some players around around the league where you go, okay, that makes sense. Like this player fits there. And I would agree, Matt Duchesne is probably a good fit for the Nashville Predators. I think he'll produce quite well there. He'll be surrounded by a lot of talent. Uh, this is no disrespect to Columbus. I think that he was surrounded by talent there as well. They had a really good team, let's not forget. I mean, they swept the damn Tampa Bay Lightning. Uh, in, in Ottawa, he produced when he didn't have a ton of talent around him. So th this is going to be great. And I think that this deal is going to work out well for both sides. I'd be interested to see if Nashville does some other stuff besides extending some of their own players. But it looks as though like there's some teams that are, are making some significant moves here and, and Nashville is one of those teams that's very active here uh, in the free agent market knocking off one of the biggest names out there and no more time to speculate it looks like Duchesne is in Nashville so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video if you're new make sure to subscribe I'd love to have more hockey conversations with you join the squad let's get to 6,000 subscribers hopefully we've hit it by the time some of these videos come out but they might all come out at once so probably not but Thank you all for supporting lots of rumor videos um, as well as, uh, you know, like trade rumors and, and free agency stuff. And also, if you want to save $20 uh, on tickets on SeatGeek, make sure to use code APH in all caps. You know, you, you always want to save some money. That's always a good thing. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. I'll see you in the next video or stream. Peace.